Hello and good day people and welcome to LA Noir. I'm here with the Pipster. Hello. And we're gonna be playing this game. Excellent. I can use my game controllers. Yes. I'd recommend it. <laughs> uh, which is good because, you know, when I can, I will happily lounge back and use a gamepad. So let's hit the new the new game key. New new button. It's generally a good place to start a game. A city on the verge of greatness. A new type of city, based not on the man, but on the automobile. The car. The symbol of freedom and vitality. Where every man can own his own home, and have room to breathe, and not be overlooked by his neighbors. The city where a man's home is his castle. A quarter acre of the dream made possible by victory. The city of opportunists. The city of dreams. Where Hollywood will shape the thoughts and desires of the entire planet. The city of pioneers. City of Dreamers. A city of undercurrents, where not everything is as it seems. A 20th century city that will become a model for the world. A city that has no boundaries, that will stretch as far as the eye can see. It's definitely a city. Yeah. Of many, many things. Mm -hmm. In the Marine Corps, you deal with the chain of command. Mistakes get made, but you deal with them. You know what you're fighting for, and that you're on the same team. But dealing with corruption is like chasing shadows. You never know whether the guy you're talking to is on the pad, or whether it's your partner, or maybe even the watch commander. So who do you trust, Cole? I made up my mind a long time ago. KGPL calling car, 14 Adam. 14 Adam, come in. Go ahead, KGPL. 14 Adam, see the detective in ambulance shooting at 6th and Industrial Street. In a 16 William request uniform assistance for an evidence search. 14 Adam, code 2. Roger, 14 Adam en route. Okay, I've got to drive a car. Excellent place to start me. Whoa, whoa! They don't whoa, jeez, look, red lights, guys. Kind of <laughs> the light. From the beam of sunset oh. That's fine. Uh, it's going well so far. Okay, I took his wing mirror off. Where am I going? Uh, that way. I can miss this way. Turn. That's fine. I'm good at driving over paint. I'm good at driving in video games. Okay, yeah. And turn. <laughs> Perfect. Hi. Anyway, crime scene. 1014. Yeah. Homicide. You might back up? Yes, sir. Phelps and Dunn, Wilshire Division. We had a shooting took place down this alleyway. We have the Vic, Scooter Payton. A Negro male bagged up and on his way to Central Morgue. Witness says a tall white guy, our shooter, put two in the Vic's head and then threw his piece. I need you guys to try and recover the gat. You want us to look anywhere in particular? Give it your best shot, guys. The dead guy's a low light. I'm not expecting any miracles here. And if we recover the weapon? Bag it and return it to technical services. You hurry it up, Floyd. We I'm got out of here. To be. Happy hunting. So we've got to find a gun. I noticed that that guy's hat this was a hurt pump. ridiculously just high. Just going up on through his head. the motions. <laughs> Probably right. Let's just get it over and done. All right, have it your way. We'll search right up to the back wall. 
If you still don't come up with anything, come find me and we'll talk it out. Two heads are always better than one. Uh, if you are a criminal and you had to throw your gun, where would you throw it? The question is, where was the corpse? Look at this junk. Because it's likely to be nearer the corpse. Is it though? Is it? Well, it depends how far he was shot from. Like, it's if I could see the whole crime scene, that would be trash. There's a, like, trash can over there, so it could be over there. Maybe. Right. Can I open this? No, nope. so it's clearly not in there. Uh... Hmm. Yeah. What have you got, Phelps? Anything? Insta heat. Yeah. Cole, come take a look at this. Oh, oh sounds like your partner's found something. Yeah, it's something that. I tell you, I'm Sorry. jinxed. I always get landed with this crap. Oh, you got where you shot. shot. So uh, the blood splatter went that way, so it was over this way somewhere. We're never gonna find it. It's a waste of time. Uh, down the alley. Probably not that way. Down the... Maybe. Think okay. It says... A to inspect an object. Oh, can I inspect like this? Yes. Okay. Lovely. Nuclear. Shooter put him up against the wall and blew his brains out. Hell of a way to go. Doesn't really matter how you go once you're gone. <laughs> Don't get all deep on me, Phelps. Most likely, I imagine. Oh, try that game, Fine Dream Pipe, so maybe it's on the Oh, that. Not that. Controller vibration. Yeah. There's, um. Things that can be examined nearby. Ah, a bottle. A cigarette! Hello? Pick it up. Circumstantial. evidence. It would take a smarter man than me to connect that. Yeah, probably nothing. Fingerprints all over a gun. <laughs> I'm not quite sure. Could this be a gun? Smith and Wesson, <gasps> serial S71893. Two Ooh, rounds fired. Two shots. And instead of dropping it down a drain, our shooter hoists it up here. Interesting guy. Follow up on this now before the perp tries to leave town. We <laughs> have the gun, Cole. Let's take it back to Central. We could get a commendation. We could show some initiative, Ralph, and see if we can come up with an owner. That's a long shot, Cole. It's a pretty fancy gun. You know a local gun store? Sure. There's a place a couple of blocks from here. Get to the gun store then. Go. Okay. Are you sure about Get back to the car so we can. No harm in doing some digging. Oh, come on, the soup didn't seem to give much of a damn. Such a rough voice down cold. You can't wait to He's get out of uniform, can you? You'd rather round up drunks and help old ladies across the road? I'd rather get through the day without the captain's foot up my ass. It'll be fine, Ralph. You worry too much. Enter the behave. 
shoot me over. Guns, guns, guns and ammunition cells, downtown outlet, set as destination. Okay, forward! Let's try not to crash into any more people. Okay, go right. Which side of the road do I drive on? The right side, right? Fine, you don't need to hide the laws of the road. This is America! <laughs> Land of the free! <laughs> I could pump it, but they crash into everyone. So. Every yeah. trigger. Uh, slam a left! Now! Go. Oh, you crazy bastard! Don't you honk at me! I'm the one that pulled out. When I was blatantly there, observe right of way, you jerk. <laughs> the police always get right away. Come on. <laughs> uh, I'm God, a police man. traffic, yo. Got to follow. Should probably turn the siren on then. How do I do that? L. L. Bump the bank. Normal, like, bump. Analog stick bump. Whoa! No, you just got Getting out, out of the, the car is not what I wanted to do. The bat oh, stick. Aha! Right. This is important emergency police business. Get out of my way. Alright. Gotta drive over the pavements when it's emergency police business. Get out of the way. Uh oh, uh oh, oh god. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> Junction was a lot further away than I thought it was. And I missed I missed my yeah. turning. Go left. Oh, 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 oh. Out of the way! Pull um, over! Go left again. Oh, oh, I nearly killed a man. Good at driving. Aha! Yeah, yeah, yeah. all in one piece. Didn't even lose any bumpers. Gun start, 10.40 p.m. That man looks bored. Officer you Phelps, think? undone. Can you tell us anything about this gun? Smith & Wesson, Model 27, registered Magnum. Chambered for 357, nickel plated with pearl grips. Same gun used by General Patton. <laughs> You're not suggesting he's the owner. No, I'm not. You seem to know a lot about the weapon. I ought to. I sold it. You know, this piece will stop a rhino. These babies are only available special order. Here's my Smith & Wesson order book. You mind if I take a look? Be my guest. This is about something bad, right? Uh, Model 27 with pearl button. grips, Cole. You see it on there? What was the, uh, thing? Uh, I don't know, can you look at your clues? Uh, I don't know what the button is. Oh, not that. That's definitely not what I want. That one. Clues. Clues. S71893. Yeah. That number. S71893. Errol Schrodinger. Schroeder. We're in luck. Errol Schroeder. 203 South Glass Street. Ordered the gun in February 46. Thanks, you've been a big help. Anytime. Always happy to help out the LAPD. He's a lovely gentleman, isn't he? Indeed. Do we call it in? Let's see if he's at home. Owning the gun doesn't prove he pulled the trigger. Okay. In for a penny, in for a pound. Lead the way, Gunga Den. Uh, Schroeder's apartment. Set the man's destination. I am already quite enjoying this. <laughs> it's pretty good. <laughs> the music's great as well. Yeah, it's pretty good. Uh. Bang. Bang. That wasn't so hard, was it? Turn on the blues and twos. Because we're in uniform doesn't mean we can't use our initiative. I guess so. Seems a little Get too good to be true. One of a kind.
behind murder weapon bought locally using a real name? If Schroeder's our shooter, uh, he's still oh. mastermind. Most of them aren't, and that's why they get caught. Two out of every three crimes are done on impulse. Another fact from the Phelps Encyclopedia of Thin Air. You really are full. Phelps appears to know his stuff, eh? He's a bit, he's a bit full of it, really, isn't he? He's a bit of a nerd. Port of police business. So I don't know why it turned off. Oh no! Oh, oh no! They could have gone much worse, to be fair. <laughs> People did not get out of my way. No, the siren does like nothing. <laughs> well, let's turn off the lights before. Before we get there. Before we get there, our voice will hear me coming. Short of the bathroom. 10.57, p.m. That took yeah. seven minutes. Apparently. Gold handle doors allow you to enter. Apparently. Okay. Let's wait for now. Oops. Schroeder. Apartment Schroeder. Two. Apartment 2. Ah, look. You said the same thing I did. <laughs> Deduction skills. Ah, oh, look. I like it when that happens, actually. <laughs> like, standing on the steps. It's like such a simple thing. What do you guys want? I'm Officer Cole Phelps. This is Officer Dunn, Wilshire Division. You're the owner of a Smith & Wesson Model 27, nickel-plated with pearl grips? I might be. What of it? Then you'll be surprised to know that Scooter Payton was murdered tonight with your gun. You're out of your mind. Scooter? He works for me. I have that gun here in my drawer. Uh, what the fuck is going on here? You're under arrest, Schroeder. Cup him, Ralph. No way. You're not taking me down for this. Whoa. Ugh. Resisting arrest much. You ready? Is they're resisting arrest and assaulting an officer. Oh. Okay. Okay, I fixed the cuff. Oh. Yeah. Get him done. Oh, oh, need him in the Ralph. face. You all right? I'm fine. I hardly felt it. He's lucky he caught me off guard. Keep an eye on him, Ralph. Need my hat. Look around. <laughs> <laughs> he actually does pick it up. Uh, <laughs> right. Um, Mr. Tails. Not everything here is going to be relevant. That. Could have been. Hmm. Oh, the cigarette, though. Ah. Not much help. But it does confirm he smokes. Same yeah. kind of cigarette, too. <laughs> the same type of generic cigarette. Kind of diary. Frank Career. Oh, okay, there's more places. Floyd Rose. List of names in a series of numbers. Floyd Rose's name is in this book. Phelps, we can come out of this all bright and shiny with a commendation, or stick our schlongs in a hornet's nest. Call it in, partner. On its nest it is. Leave the book where you found it. <laughs> Officer Phelps, that's 1247. Hmm. That's Mayfield schlong, really. I don't think we did stick our schlong in the hornet's nest, though. I think he pussy it out.
You dumb fucking sons of bitches, get in this line now before I lose my temper. Excuse me, Sergeant, but... Excuse me? Fuck you. You say another word and I'll break your fucking head and have you in the brig. Some of us are here for... I know why you're here, asswipe. I'm having a bad day, Private. Some people don't seem to want to get on this bus. Didn't ask for your help. He didn't ask for your help. Can you believe this guy? Who are you two? Abbott and Costello? We're here for OCS, Sergeant. So it's the three fucking stooges and you're here for OCS. God help this fucking country in the USMC. The Japanese will do the world a favor and kill you quickly. All three of you are on report. What are your fucking names? Phelps. Kelso. Merrill. Any other gentlemen for OCS? OCS is at Elliot. You take the Camp Elliot bus over there. This bus is for MCRD. This bus is for men who want to fight. What an asshole. What an asshole. That's not a very good way to motivate people, is it, really? Yelling at them and calling them fuckers. I'm the nigger. You picked the right place, Cole. A city that needed an honest cop like a thirsty man needed water. You'd heard the stories, but you weren't interested. You were here to fight the good fight, solve cases, right wrongs. The force is like politics. There's no city on the fence. You have to choose sides. A brown paper envelope or a Greyhound ticket to Palookaville. It could only ever end one way. All units at 211 in progress and shots fired at Westlake Savings and Loan, 1415 West 3rd Street. Unit handle identifying code 3. We'll take that. It's only a couple blocks from 14 here. Adam calling KGPL. We'll handle the 211. Roger that, 14 Adam. Be advised suspects are armed and dangerous. Roger, KGPL. 14 Adam on route. Okay. Let's go. Looks like it's time for some armed combat training. Yeah. Only a little bit. Just a bit. Let's make savings alone. 9.18 am. That's a nice gun. Golden. I'm gonna shoot. The idea is to shoot the bad guys, not the, the building. Good at shooting. Oh. Up. Weapons on the ground. Stick your head up again. There you go. Oh. <laughs> he got it. Oh, no. Come on. Stay down. Try for the front door, keep your goddamn head down. Use the cover, Phelps. We don't know how many are in there. Uh, Take it slow. Backup will be here soon. I don't need no backup. Backup. Oh, oh, oh. Just took a chunk out of that fellow. Get out of the way. You almost hit the clock there. Damn it, Greg. You're here to kill bad guys, not to kill time. Kill a oh, no. And it's the electric chair. Oh, hello. Oh, oh no. You didn't even That's shoot it. anywhere near him. <laughs> I think we got him, Cole. Should be all clear. Should it, though? Lieutenant Hopkins says anytime you reach for the shotgun, you're either going to end up dead or wearing a citation. So I guess... It's okay, Ralph. You did well in there. He didn't have a shotgun. Man couldn't ask for a better partner. Didn't have a shotgun, he had a pistol. I had a shotgun. So I'm either gonna wind up dead or have a citation. He'll be fine. This kind of opportunity 
Comes along once in a lifetime, Hank. <laughs> I have to grasp it. You have to survive at first, Cole. Here are the veterans. The Japs love to shoot officers. If I can make a name for myself in this war, my future... Thinking of taking on a company of the Emperor's finest single-handed? You don't seem the Sergeant York type to me. When I need your opinion, Kelso, I'll ask for it. They talk about officers like you in boot camp, Cole. They call it the Custer Syndrome. Guys who go around dreaming of fame and glory and getting all of their men killed in the process. Our duty is to lead, Kelso. And their duty is to die for your wonderful future? Damn it, Kelso. Kelso's a jerk, too. It's almost as if he cares about his men. Cole Phelps and Jack Kelso. Warren Phelps. With some standing. people, it's as simple as chemistry. Two guys who should have been friends, but their personalities got in the way. Phelps, a good guy, wound way too tight. And Kelso, a quiet man who could never walk away from a fight. Well, it's a shame you don't like to talk about it, Cole. Ralph, friends who want to stay friends don't discuss religion or politics. And in my case, you can add the war to that. I know that bomb. Wendell Bowers. I put him away before he jumped parole. Get after him, Phelps. I'll head him off in the car. Wendell oh, Bowers, good. stop! LAPD! Okay, I was gonna stop, but <laughs> clearly this is not the time for that. I'm gonna hop our fence. He's hiding in the alley. Whoa! Get him. There's no way to sprint. Oh, no. Hold it right there. I'm running. Right. Stop now, or I will sprint. shoot. Sprint. I won't tell you again, Wendell. Jesus, done. Watch your fire. Don't. Oh, no, 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 no. Whoa! Right what are you doing? Now. The controls, like. Okay, right. I, I was adjusting it to like up because I was going up, but then it was. Give it up, Wendell. Where'd he go? There. Come back here. It's like Spider Man. Only without the powers. Already screwed me once. Oh, jump. Uh. It's over, Bowers. Yeah, action roll. Parkour. Give it up, Bowers. There's nowhere left to go. Oh, oh close, close line. The place to ourselves. Oh, yeah, fist the cops. Yeah. Come on, then. Ah, uh, you should have thrown him. <laughs> Scatter. Your parole officer's feeling lonely. He's got a hole in his life for an asshole like you. You can make it up to him in ten years' time. Watch your head. This hump will be back in the Iron Hotel by tomorrow night. Nice work, Cole. You run track in high school? Alright, I think now it's time to pull over. No. More Part cinematics. Of the of the More flashbacks. Being an officer in the Marine Corps is the ability to make tough decisions. The right decision is not always the popular one. The right decision will get the men you care about killed. These ratings and your ability to give them frankly and truthfully directly affect your chances of successfully becoming a Marine officer. Candidate Phelps, you have the floor. Esprit de corps. Merrill, 10. Franklin, 8. Weiss, 8. Donahoe, 6. Kowalski, 6. Hudson, 5. Kelso, 2. Leadership. Donahoe, 8. Franklin, 7. Merrill, 6. Kowalski, 6. Weiss, 5. Hudson, 5. Kelso, one. Candidate Kelso! I'm sorry, Captain, but I joined the Marine Corps to fight the enemy, not get involved in this schoolboy chicken shit. Kelso, in my office, now! Kelso's not a very good officer. 
No, it's probably because he's an asshole. <laughs> probably. Bye, beware. For every cop, there's the case that makes you. Gives you that leg up. Gets you recognized as the shining new star in the squad. The case that you solve that shows that you have the gumption, the gung-ho, the get-up-and-go to make you stand out from your average rank-and-file patrolman. This could be the one goal. LAPD, could you stand clear of the body, please? Has anyone called an ambulance? We've called an ambulance and the police, but I'm afraid he's dead. <laughs> okay, stand further back and move along. It's your choice, but make it quick, people. Hey, Cole. You got here quick. My beat crosses 7th Street. Okay. You're first reporting, then. We'll get a perimeter going and move the crowd on. You better see what you can find out before the homicide dicks show up. I'll be with you in a moment. Right, well, Everybody that stay looks back. like a good job. place to stop for now. So, next time we'll come back, we'll investigate what happened here. What went down. Well, I can tell you what went down. Dude got shot. Twice. Well, that looks like a, a lot more, than, more than two bullets, but I only heard two shots in the thing. But hey, could have been several guys shooting exactly the same time. You're right. You're right. Synchronized shooting. Well, thanks for watching, guys. Please remember to leave a like, comment, and of course subscribe. I'll see you all next time. Bye. Bye.